Bruins 13-2-1 in their last 16. The Islanders 7-1-1 in their last nine. The game is on. McAvoy picks up Brock Nelson's mishandle. Slides it over to Coyle. Smith the trailer. Coyle dumps Pellick. Carlos drive. Smith scores! The Bruins go with the flow. 4-0-3 into the game. We touched on it, and it's winning battles. It's a good steal right there after the uh, loss of the puck by Brock Nelson. It allows the Bruins, even though it's not tape to tape in the neutral zone, it's body contact down deep. Coil down the wall, overpowers Pellick. Pellick, Zach Parisi, shoved to the corner by forward. Matthew Barzal twists inside, had a good save by Omar. Anders Lee yields to Brock Nelson. Nelson in front, and Olmark makes the stop close range on Anthony Bovillier. Green up the middle for Nelson. He goes around forward. One stop by Olmark, robbing Josh Bailey. Dobson rails it around. Brock Nelson deflects it slot. Two Bruins there, but Boston can't clear the zone. Dobson fakes the shot. Frederick. Hunts the puck. Nelson gets it to Dobson. Fires and scores. Palmieri. The armpit high tip. Yeah, the referees are talking about it because it was deflected. Where this stick makes contact with the puck. It starts high by Palmieri. And he's on his way down with the stick. But where does the puck make contact? Uh, that's going to be inconclusive. Mm. What was the call? Did they say it was a good goal? Apparently, because <laughs> the puck is at center. If the call stands, not reversed, Boston will not be penalized for delay of game. Upon video review, the puck was played with a high stick, therefore we have no goal. Everything but score on that man advantage, and they're right back on it again. McAvoy closes the tip by Hall. It's 2-0. Sean Letty shooting mentality and the pressure all over the zone. With continuous action, but again, second effort league. Marshawn able to win that draw with Bergeron. Get the puck to the top of the umbrella. Move laterally to improve your angle. And then with your eyes up. And Bergeron occupied Pollock. What does that open up? That opens up Taylor Hall just to the side of that post with a nice little redirect on the glove side. Yeah, the effort off the faceoff, though. Again, yeah. Brad Marchand makes a great play to get the puck to McAvoy. You know, when, when Bergeron was unavailable, Charlie Coyle does a pretty decent job in that. Oh! oh. Uh, Nelson scores with 11.8 showing. Chara off the pipe. Now 11 goals in 13 games. Now the Bruins actually win this draw. I don't think they get credit for the win. But they pull the puck behind them. But enters Lee. Parisi jamming against Grizzly. Grizzly wins the puck battle. Paul paddles it off the corner boards. Aho. Confronted by Hall on one side, Hall on the other, and Pasternak scores! The Bruins have scored four goals in 22 minutes and 13 seconds than they had in previous two games. By Taylor Hall, put the puck down deep. We just talked about the thrust, pursuit, pursuit, pursuit. And the Bruins do that as well when they make the line change. Hall is in there, Pasenak's in there. Hall of... Noah Dobson right to McAvoy. Catch and release to Coyle. Frederick to Smith. A great save by Varlamo. Play the game the right way. Don't let those types of things, even though there are mistakes made when any goal is scored, 
You just keep playing the game, and that's the way they've come out here in the second. Marshawn tries to get between Pellick and scores! Yeah, it's a face-off win by the Islanders, but again, the pressure on the forecheck. It starts with the brush. There's, there's Marshawn, and you can see the reaction by Pellick. He looked like he almost got injured on the play. Marshawn just tries to get himself back in the mix. Bergeron tries to make a play to the net. Bounces the pass. The got, lucky, got lucky there. Barzal around Frederick. Dobson's wrist shot. A save by Olmark and a score on the rebound. Anders Lee. Doing what he does best. 11 games now. Yeah, just a simple overload on one side. Dobbs is going to work the blue line. He gets his shot through. Omar can't squeeze it off. He can't get a handle on it. And it allows a second chance opportunity. First by Pajot to keep the play alive. And you're right, Jag. Anders Lee, we watch this all the time. He gets his stick on pop. Beauvillier. Right in front. Palmieri denied by Olmark. Five minutes of continuous play. McAvoy wins the puck battle. Taylor Hall cuts around Bailey. Gives to Pasternak. Oh, 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 what a marvelous goal. The Bruins won't let the Islanders draw a breath. More than five minutes of continuous play ends in a tick. Goal. In the neutral yeah. zone that puts this all in play. Little pump fake right there. Now he gets easy entrance. Attack right down the middle of the ice. Create your two on one. Get the puck to Pasenak. Pasenak off that right hip. He sells shot. Paula, he's just getting open in preparation for a perfect pass. Pasenak tries the short side. Pasternak has a negative angle shot. Well positioned in the offensive zone. Nice move. Tack the net by going wide on the back end to his forehead. DeBrus tries in and ho oh, oh. ho! The bounces are going the hustler's way. Six to Boston. You know, and if you can add production to that kind of help us win hockey games, he becomes a valuable asset. You know how skilled he is. He's a good finisher in and around the net, whether he's on. Bavillier to Parisi. Pollock. Palmieri closes. Across to Balbillier, and a tip in by Parisi. 6-3. 5-17 to go. Bruins got a little over-aggressive on the PK. The initial play, looking for Parisi at the top of the paint, off that weak side post. Maybe bothered a little bit by Frederick rotating back. And then Parisi strong on his stick. I don't know if that hits his stick. His stick and his skate. But it's a nice seam pass, Palmieri to Billier with a little pump fake. Great effort by Boston this afternoon, and fans letting him know. The Bruins have won 14 of their last 17, and for a few hours at least, rise to second place.